Hello. It is currently 1045 and the Maple Leafs have just lost the play-in round. 3 to 0. They were shut out. Oh god, it was sad. I stayed up and watched all of it on my phone too. And I'm just like like, they have one job. Columbus is just, like, bullies, though. And, like, that's the thing about hockey is, like, you know, the, you gotta bully your way to the Stanley Cup, and Toronto doesn't have that. They've got star power, but they don't have the bully factor, so they just got their shit rocked, and, I mean, it was a good effort, I guess, but whatever. I'm just really upset. <sighs> anyway, bedtime. Oh yeah, too, before I go to bed and everything, it's about to air everything. My camera is on. I wonder how long it's going to take for us to go out. I don't know. Maybe we'll have to pay for it. Anyway, no, I'm gonna go to bed. Fuck, you know, I just. Oh. Why does hockey have to be so miserable? But I love the sound of the <laughs> Yo, what up? Just woke up. This is. My sunburn, not that bad. I can't feel it. It's just really warm. But, you know. It's not that bad. So, whatever. Okay, listen. I'm about to just spill some truth on you. Yes, I have watched the majority of Rain Sounds 10 Hours. Sean Avery. <laughs> oh my god. Even if you're not a hockey fan, I'm telling you, you have to listen to him speak. He is literally, um, is it Patrick ba Bateman? Is that his name? The main character from, uh, American Psycho. He is the real life version. Like, even outside of hockey, he's fucking batshit insane. But it's, like, reasonable. Like, he always backs it up. So, and this, this is what I'll be watching. Mom's gone. Dad's gone. Dolly has cheese in her ear. So I gotta give her a bath. I gotta do summer reading work. Because today we start next Wednesday. Holy shit. I gotta do that. I don't want to. I don't know anything about it. I should be fine, I guess. I don't know. You tell me. Is it going to be fine? I don't know. And you're going to have for the rest of your uh, life. That's the most famous arena in the history of the arenas ever. Like the most Sean Avery. Yeah, mm -hmm. it could be. I mean, I think the redo is pretty good. But it's also. It's um, still mortified by last night's game. However, spitting chickies. I'm going to go put on my hoodie. Because I feel like it. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh. The schedule for. Round one came out. And. Dallas and Calgary play tomorrow. At like 5.30. And then they play at 10.30. And then they play at 10.30 again. And then they play at 2 o'clock. I have a pet bowl right there. And it hurts. Well, it's just annoying. It doesn't hurt, but you get what I mean. Hockey, girl. I look like a boy. Please, for the love of God, can I get a yabba dabba do? Bro, oh my God, are you kidding me? 
Yeah, that's right. I'm wasting time so I don't have to do my summer reading. Fuck you. Good day sleeping on Donald. You all right with that? Up, it's, it's possible to win at this league if you're if you're paying cert, like a, a certain number of guys too much money. And we're seeing it more and more. Cowboy and hit. Fine line and fine balance, but Dave Hansen from the... Going up, you know, things don't necessarily look like... Slapshot the, movie, that. Paul Newman. Dude, Paul you Newman's so handsome, but Dave Hansen played one of the Hansen brothers because the movie's based off of Dave Hansen. Fun fact. So... I have to pee. You guys want to know something disgusting? I literally can't have hoodies. Because look at all the hair. Like it goes into the... Oh God. And it's just all like cat hair, dog hair, my hair, a lot of my hair. Just filthy. Let's flip it over. And it's like lint rollers don't do shit, because look at this, it's like in the fabric. Sure, I can like pull all the hair that I want, but it's gonna go right back in in like two seconds. Mm. And that just like grows, look at it. You guys can't even see, this is like terrible quality too. Well, I don't know, whatever. How you doing, Bumpy? Yeah? Me too. Hi, this is Jonathan calling on behalf of Donald J. Trump for president. I'm calling people like you in the North Carolina area to invite you to participate in a special, live, toll-free meeting with Kellyanne Conway. If you receive this message by 11.40 a.m. Eastern Time and would like to join the live free call. I think it's Seinfeld time. The puffy shirt. I have seen this episode in the past. Um, because I know there was also a Hannah Montana episode. The pirate shirt. It was almost the exact same. Would you stop a little? Thank you. But I really don't want to do some reading. I know I have to, but I keep putting it off. And I need to bathe Dolly. But I need to wait for Henry to wake up before I bathe Dolly. And then after I bathe Dolly, I know I'll be really tired. And then I need to shower. I should probably just do the summer reading now. I don't want to. I don't know if I starve. Am I proud of me? I just want to watch the intro. I don't know. We got her going. I'm sorry. It's going to be okay, Buffy. It'll be alright. I promise. Look at the little puppy. Oh my goodness. You look insane. You alright? It's okay. I got you. Don't even worry about it. Alright? I'm gonna let you run around. It's gonna be your favorite part. It always is. You're gonna be okay. I got you. You're so clean. You got cheese out of your ear. That's gonna feel better. Hello. You got anything to say? And she's off. Whoa. She's getting aggressive. Woo She's shaking so bad and I don't know what to do. It's like she wants something, so I just put her in a bunch of blankets and she's still shaking. 
Are you okay? Of course, as soon as I put the camera on her, she doesn't shake, but that's life. Oh no, it's scary. I want her to be okay, doggy. Look at this. I took her outside to go pee, and the first thing she does is roll around in the dirt and the mud. What are you doing? Come on. Oh, it's all in your fur, Dolly. Oh my god. Are you shitting me? Stupid whore. Oh god. It's kind of shaking, though. I gotta go to ticket. High Point always makes me feel good because they send me stuff, but I know that they send it to everybody, so I feel less good. But look, it's a golden ticket. It's like actual. Yay. President Nito Quibin. Anyway. Hey, does anyone know Sarah Schultz from uh, High Point who sends all those emails? Will someone tell that bitch to lay off? Oh my god. Sarah Schultz. Also, I totally forgot to mention that today the first overall team is decided who gets the first overall pick, which is probably Alex Lafreniere. Yeah, more hockey talk. What of it? Um, since all of the qualifying teams are out, we'll see who gets it. So the New York Rangers just got the first overall pick. Last year they had the second overall. So they got Capocaco. That's a real name. Um, and it didn't. You know he's eighteen. Like he's got to break into the league, but didn't do too hot off the get-go. Probably did better than Jack Hughes, because he did really bad. Um, but yeah. Man. <laughs> I'm gonna go. Hey, man. Hey, man.